The International Bureau of Education in Geneva is where school programs and curricula for countries around the world are developed. It gives strategic advice and technical support to the countries trying to innovate their national curriculum. The IBE has collected school books from all over the world for almost a century. But the focus is not exclusively on the past. It's very much concerned with the present and future education models. At IBE we don't talk about an ideal curricula. We talk that different curricula can be effective in different contexts, according to the national priorities, to the national aspirations, to the national definition of education. The curricula have to connect the content, what you want to teach, with the learner's needs and motivation. And that implies rethinking contents that are much more attentive to learner's needs and expectations. Traditionally, when we talk about curricula, we talk about teachers. And we don't talk much about the learners in the center stage. Today, when we talk about education and curricula reforms and processes, we are talking that the learner has to take the center stage in the educational process. The educational process aims to help pupils understand what they're learning so they can apply it in later life. According to one IBE expert, to reform a curriculum today, you should look beyond borders because we live in an increasingly globalized world. But context is all important. We take into account world trends and international studies. We compare ourselves to other countries, which is sometimes a bit too simplistic because we tend to forget to take into account the context. In recent years, Finland has always been quoted as having a very efficient education system, always scoring top in the PISA studies. But you have to take into account the context in Finland. If you transfer the Finnish system to Italy, you can't be sure it would work. Perhaps it wouldn't. For many years now, education policy makers worldwide have been looking to other countries for inspiration on improving their own national curricula. But the ideal one-size-fits-all system remains as elusive as ever. <laughs>